Welcome to Overwatch, the game where I pick only one hero and refuse to switch. We lose the game and I break my ass. And today, we're going to do just that with... Widowmaker. Codename, Broken Spine. The purple lady femme fatale known for such actions is one-shotting you when you pop ultimate and being stared at down below. But what is Widow's story? Widow was originally an accomplished ballet dancer in Paris by the name, um... Amelie LaCroix. That, and was husband to a very accomplished Overwatch agent, um... Gerard LaCroix. Yeah. After a significant amount of attempts to assassinate him, Talon chose to focus on his wife instead. They kidnapped her and subjected her to massive amounts of neurological reconditioning and suppressed her entire personality. She was eventually found looking completely normal and 100% like the young girl she was supposed to be. Then, two weeks later, she killed her husband in her sleep. With that done, she returned to town, and they consistently altered her physically, lowered her heart rate, which is why she has a blue skin tone, and numbed her standard human emotions. Now we have Widowmaker, the sniper who only really cares about a good kill and having a lot of porn made about her. But what is she like in game? Well, she's a sniper with an extremely skinny hitbox and a ton of damage if used correctly. Now, Widowmaker and Hanzo are two major snipers that both get a lot of shit. Hanzo more so, because, you know, weebs. But Widow is generally a difficult hero to play. Overwatch is a fast game, and your aim needs to be fast as well. To play Widow effectively, you gotta be able to keep track him. But when you do, she is one of the strongest team clears. Being able to one-shot headshot over about 75% of the cast from an insanely long range, along with wall hacks, a grapple hook, machine gun for close range, Widowmaker puts the ass in Assassin very well. So starting off, we have the bang bang move. Does 13 damage, 10 rounds per second, 30 ammo, and then boom, you're having a panic attack. And then we have the bang move. 12 to 120 damage, 1.25 RPS, two and a half times headshot multiplier, and boom, one shot. So then you got your spider move. It's 15 damage a second for 75 damage total, five second duration, boom coffin then you have the grapple move 13 meters a second 20 meter range boom high places and finally her knowledge move no map wide effect 15.5 second duration 1375 points boom hacks let me get this off my chest right now I suck major ass as Widowmaker. This is horrible gameplay. If you've seen me play any video game, you for damn sure that my aim is absolutely garbage. This is most likely due to me using a mouse at 4,000 DPI base, but I refuse to change it. You can't tell me what to do, Dad. What I do have is a little bit of game knowledge. So the gameplay you might see is kind of shit, but at least I know things. You see, Widow's one of those characters that makes picks, and those picks change the scope, <laughs> scope of the game. Like a sniper in literally any game, you need to position yourself in the right spot to cause the correct amount of pain you want to ensue. Once an opportunity presents itself, you can one-shot an enemy and turn the fight in your favor, being able to immediately remove a Mercy, a Genji, a McCree, a Mei, Anyone from the game can be a massive lifesaver. That single person, that one death, can turn the fight from a losing one to a winning one. And normally, you won't stop. You just keep going pop, 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 person to person to person, just getting rid of everyone if their positioning allows you to. That's what makes Widowmaker such a fight changer. Her picks are pretty good, and if you get that one pick and a big fight breaks out, you can just keep up the pressure and really screw over some people's days. Widowmaker can practically clear out most of a team in four or five shots, so long as you're good enough with her, and that's very impressive. Welcome to the Widowmaker PSA. If I'm a widow main, remember these things. Number one, yes, I know what's on the internet about me. Thank you. Number two, I can literally turn fights around from losing to winning in a few shots, so don't discount how good a widow main can be. Number three, yes, I can aim. And number four, not every fight will have me killing off like three people. If we lost a fight, maybe blame you charging in instead of the shit widow in the corner. This has been a widow PSA. Thank you for watching. When it comes to butt touch, heh, <laughs> butt touching, Widow is very good at countering Pharaoh, Bastion, and Mercy. Now, Pharaoh is destroyed by hit scan, and Widow is an easy one-shotter, and Pharaoh's like in the air. It's super easy to kill her. 
Bastion is immobile, so Widow can easily pop out, shoot him, pop back, pop out, shoot him, no repercussions. Mercy is generally out in the open healing, and so long as she is, Widow has her sights on her all the time and can easily take her out. Widowmaker gets butt touched by Genji, Diva, and Winston. Genji's deflect can actually turn a one shot into a suicide, and he's great at sticking to you easily. Diva can block your shots, so you can get immediately into your face, causing you huge issues. And Winston's bubble blocks your shots, but he's also Winston. Let's be real, if you main Widow, you already hate Winston. For cosmetics, the best blue skin is the pink one, the best purple skin is the gold one, the best legendary is Town Widow or Beach Widow, the best emote is Ballet, the best victory pose is the Toast, the best voice line is... Désolé. The best spray is this one, cause reason, and the best highlight intro is the Mistletoe one. So let's wrap up Widow. She's 100% the reason why you can't climb in Overwatch. All these damn Widow mains thinking they can join my game, play, how dare they? How dare they join my video games and play their sniper character? This is why I'm in bronze. Anyway, thank you for watching my one trick guide to Widowmaker. If you enjoyed it, my just checking out the January Loot Crate themes this week. We have some pretty nice ones this month, and you should go to lootcrate.com slash Bricky in the description and use promo code Bricky for 10% off. My name is Bricky, of course, and be careful where you look. Spiders are mean. Bye-bye.